Yeah, we're right there. I was adopted and I used to live at China. We had always thought we wanted to adopt, but at one point we were like, okay, we're done with our family, two was enough. And then we just really felt like it was something we wanted to do. So we all got together and we talked about it and then prayed about it. And then this little guy was brought to us. Uh -huh. We wanted a boy and to be able to get a boy, you had to go their special needs route. So we had always said we wouldn't, you know, mind some a child with a missing limb that was fine for us. And then he came, his little picture came in the mail and we were like, absolutely. We saw this video oh, like a couple of years ago and we had asked Jeremy, we showed it to him, would you want to, have, you know, get a prosthetic arm? He was like, no, nah, I'm fine the way I am. And then about, I don't know, when sometime in November, my neighbor next door, Sharon, she said, ah, oh, I saw this really cool video of these prosthetic arms, 3D. You think Jeremy would, would be interested? I said, oh, you know, I asked him a while ago and he said, no, I said, let's show him again. And then he was like, yeah, I want one. Then one day my sister's like, you know, I'm gonna Google 3D, see if there's any 3D printing places on Staten Island. And she Googled it and Mike's name, you know, his company came up. She emailed him and like four minutes later, he called her back and was like, I would love to do this. I've been wanting to do something like this for like four years. Um, when we first saw him, we thought it was so cool because he was so happy to just do things like shake a hand or he was like scratching his head, holding a cup, like just doing things, clapping, things that um, we take for granted with two hands and it was just nice to see. He's very well adjusted without it. He does almost anything, but doing those little things, it's pretty cool to see him do that. A few times I tried to pick up an apple, but... but then it fell down a few times. But then when you were able to do it, what was it like? How did it make you feel? Awesome! So now you're going to be showing your friends. Mm -hmm. On Sunday. Oh, that's exciting. Are you excited about that? Yeah, boy! <laughs> How did you uh, feel when you saw the Transformers? Is that your favorite? I felt like mind blown. Is Optimus Prime your favorite character? Yeah. So you see these. The strings go through here. Then it goes around here. It connects to here. Then it splits into five. One activates the thumb. One activates the pointer. One activates the middle finger. One activates the ring finger. And one activates the pinky finger. When you bend it, the strings pull back because it's because you're you're using strings. I would tell them, and I could would tell them, believe in what you could do. Never don't believe. <laughs>